Indeed, Alex. For a second there, I thought you guys were gonna have to break up. But once he gets to that Kakui party, oh, he'll be so grateful. He'll bend all the rules for you. Oh, now I get it. I just thought Alex was being uncharacteristically generous. Me. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you generous. <laughs> Fair enough. There's something wrong with that spell. Or maybe it's me. No, it's gotta be the spell. <laughs> You'll come around. They always do. Well, I don't know who they are, but I'm not one of them. <laughs> you know, with those glasses and that robe on, you remind me of someone. Is it Terry something, Barry something, Larry something? Oh, never mind. <laughs> you know what today's a great day for? Today's a great day for throwing myself into work. Take orders and not talk about my problems. Slice salami and not talk about my problems. Be nice to rude customers and not tell them about my problems. You know me, service with a smile. Oh, honey, you sound like you want to talk about your problems. Mom, why are you always in my business? See what's in the box. Oh gosh. I know, I'm gonna freak out. Okay. Uh, I thought I smelled an animal backstage. <laughs> I think I did. Is so that you? <laughs> I feel like it's hair. Yes, it is hair. Cause I be the baby beat, Bobby Ting, bang and body. So. Oh, right, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll but how a... many have you had already? Uh, well, I had this. <laughs> That'll be telling. Huh? <laughs> you know a lot of stuff about stuff people really don't care about, which is great, but I know about relationships. I know how girls think. So do I. They're right brain dominant and they have a slightly larger hypothalamus. <laughs> there you go again, knowing stuff people don't care about. Why didn't you take my advice? Lots of people do. I'm the one that told Vice Principal Clements to fix his dead tooth. Now he's getting married. She was right. Who was right? Me! <laughs> I was so right. I'm the one who told him if he didn't kiss you soon, you were gonna think that he wasn't all that into you. And that's what you're thinking, right? You're not paying attention. That isn't like you. Yeah, it's like me. And you're not even doing it right. I completely check out. This place could be burning and I wouldn't even know it. You gotta show me how you do that. Unless you wanna be daddy's little girl, I can't help you. But that shirt's got you halfway there. She's still mad about all that stuff you said about evil Longoria. Yeah, Mom was pretty upset about all that stuff. Let's relive it. We'll play parts. I call Mom! You didn't make a giant burrito out of Max again, did you? No, Mom. It's no fun anymore. He likes it. You might want to put a jacket on because it's very chilly outside. Fine. Stop all the racket, I'll wear a jacket. Hey. Hey. You're so lucky. I can't even magically switch my jackets without my dad threatening to send me to jail. <laughs> What's with you and the tiny stuff? Como se dice... Lampito. Lampara. It's okay. Como se dice... Capito. Okay, now this is gonna be hard to believe, but I've never kissed a girl. I find it hard to believe that you think that I find that hard to believe. <laughs> Hola! Guess who got an A on her makeup test? Oh, you know what the Spanish say. See. Si. Don't thank me. I didn't rat you out because I'm gonna get even for you guys getting even. Yeah, I still have to write an essay so I'll get chosen to go to the World School Summit at the UN. Yeah, once he said essay, all I heard was blah, 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 blah. 
Oh, Brad, you're so funny. If we were going in a group to the concert, everyone would laugh at you. Oh, my gosh, someone sent me flowers. I wonder who it could be. Me! <laughs> You should put a cell phone in it, call it, and leave it a voicemail so that way someone in the future can pick it up. Mm, no, actually, people take my calls now. Why don't you rest your head on Frankie's shoulder and tell him all about it? I would, but I don't have time for you to get a ladder. Hey, somebody fix these dice. Why are you looking at me? Yeah, you should look at me. <laughs> all right, this is what we're gonna do. First of all, take out $5. Why? I need five dollars. But we're so good together. I mean, we have so many good memories. Remember you, me, and the penguins at the zoo? What are you doing? I'm acting out our favorite memories. Just give me one second. Let me ask my parents. Mom, Dad, some dude from Fashion Vital Magazine just offered me an internship, and I'm gonna take it. Oh, okay. <laughs> they said yes. You should have an open and honest talk with Riley to establish trust. Then you'll have a firm foundation for the future. Ew, that sounds like something old couples in their 20s would do. From your chin to your toes, an elephant trunk grows. <laughs> Russo! Um, th that really wasn't meant for you, sorry. Wow, your life is so much easier than mine. I'd have to walk all the way over there, ask the guy to make me a hot dog. I would have been exhausted. Ugh. <laughs> Alex, what happened to Riley? We broke up like an hour ago. Where have you been? <laughs> After grieving over Riley for 15 minutes, I met Manny, and it was love at first sight. You should go out with him. Ew, gross. That's exactly how I felt about your father when I first met him, and now he's my big cuddly bug. Ew, grosser. What? I changed us back as soon as you caught me. I caught you at the register at the mall. Now, nothing could go wrong. Oh, I hope I didn't jinx that. Yo, happy go trashy, come back here. Don't you see me sweeping? What would your mother say if she saw you do that, huh? Mama would be mad. That's right, Mama would be mad, and so am I. Now pick that up. And that cup, too. Okay, thank you for eating at Waverly Substation. Come again. Ooh, free refill. Hey, it's mine. What kind of powers do these glasses give you? None. They just look wonderful with the black bathrooms. Great, we're accessorizing ugly. Mom, Dad, please don't make me stay. It's so hard being me. <laughs> you didn't come here for me. You came here for you. I wanted us to be more than friends, but you're not even a friend. I think we should break up. Break up? We were never going out. Well, in my mind, we were. But now that's all over. How does it feel to be theoretically dumped? Yeah, why can't you be more like your brother? Because I don't want to grow old alone. <laughs> Class is starting. Beat it. What happened to your face is apply your makeup with a hammer. <laughs> we all know that I'm the one that's going to win the family wizard contest and keep my powers. Yeah, that's not for a long while, Justin. And what if they change the rules so only girls keep their powers? Oh, wait, you still might win. Well, Justin Russo report to Lost and Found. We have your cape and lightsaber. Hmm. <laughs> I can't believe they found where I hid those. Hey, Alex, can I get a turkey sandwich? Yeah, I'm off the clock. You know where everything is. But that new guy, Justin's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, the coolest. Justin looks great in his uniform. <laughs> he slept in it last night. I'll take you to the fall dance. And what makes you think I'd want to go to the fall dance with you? Every girl does, don't they? <laughs> yeah, you're right, okay, you got a deal. You broke the rules and used magic because you wanted Riley to ask you out. I did no such thing, and it totally worked. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. Your report on crystal balls, history, usage, and manufacturing? Crystal balls, usage and manufacturing. Oh, I did mine on how to use the really little ones for earrings. Cute, huh? End of report. Did you guys know most wizard accidents happen within a mile of the home? That's because some people have brothers and they're not accidents. No one will get better grades just by batting their eyes and trying to look cute. Are you talking about me? 